Hanging out here in the studio with Dale Jones, Kevin Patterson in the house. We're going to be with Funny Bones to St. Charles this weekend. I feel like we're in a lineup. I know. <laughs> it's a weird I'm standing out like suspect. a sore thumb, too, aren't I? I didn't do it. I swear. Yeah, it wasn't, wasn't me. me. Take, take Get one progressively step bigger. Right. Exactly. Turn to the right. Turn don't, to the right. Don't forget his tattoo, Ed. All right. So <laughs> nice. Look yeah, at you with the raise in Arizona. You know, Sweet. I, I go right there. All right. So a uh, c- couple of stories I want to share with you guys. Kind of get your feel on it. You know, uh, we're in the news. Cool. Well, yeah, because sure. people always want my input. They want your input. So you'd think that a lot of the big items would be handled pretty well at the Olympics, right? like food for the athletes, but apparently in Paris right now, there's a shortage of eggs and chicken because they didn't, they were trying to have a smaller carbon footprint, so they want more plant-based options. But the athletes are like, we eat eggs and chicken, that's how we get ready. What, what, do, you, what do you think of that story? You think, uh, Who was that swimmer? He got busted Phelps? for smoking weed. He was oh, plant-based. No, no. Lochte. Lochte. Ryan Lochte. Well, no, no, no. T- yeah. yeah, he was plant-based. Yeah, yeah they, I think they're talking more on the food side. Oh, the food yeah, side. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. I don't know why you wouldn't have protein for athletes. Right. Who's exactly. filling up on brie and then running? Yeah, you don't do that. I, oh. I, mean, I mean, I have, but usually the police are behind me. <laughs> when I train for my 5Ks, I'm like full croissants and baguettes. Really? Yeah. Yeah. So eggs and, yeah. I, I, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Croissant yeah. dipped in glaze. Yeah. My idea of plant-based yeah. is starts with Mad Dog. <laughs> 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 But I'm probably not going to meddle either, so. That's true. <laughs> That's true. Hey, don't say yourself <laughs> short. You never know. All right, how about this? Uh, near Chicago on Monday, uh, this scene happened. The Oscar, Oscar <laughs> Meyer Wienermobile was in an accident. <laughs> <laughs> and it blocked traffic for several hours, right? <laughs> there it is up on the flatbed. Uh, there was a man, the very proud. <laughs> My wiener stopped traffic. <laughs> 9.30 a.m. I wasn't sure you were going to go there. I don't know. They, they put a picture of a big hot dog and a thing in front of me, and I, I'm sorry. This is not my fault. Well, it's got me wondering if there's not an attack on junk food, because this happened in Cornwall, England. Take a look at this. We've got a uh, ice cream truck that is, uh, well, it's being washed out to sea. No! Oh, look at that. Wow. Well, first of all, I didn't know what Cornish ice cream was until I looked at it. Who's in there, Ben or Jerry? <laughs> That's just nobody sad. hurt. Nobody, nobody hurt. hurt. Good. Nobody but, hurt. But we're, you know, no suspects under who may have. Are there kids still swimming out to it, going ice cream? I want some ice cream. <laughs> we know, <laughs> Mama, give me a dollar. <laughs> we Get know Corn- Cornwall is only six hours and four minutes from Burnley, and Burnley is where well, That's one girl resides who we think could be involved in this. Okay. Yeah, she's a little upset. All right, I didn't know where Cornwall was. I thought you was cussing at me for a second. All right, go ahead. <laughs> Just two ice creams with two chewing gums in it yeah. for bloody nine pounds for two of them. Nine quid for two? Yeah, nine quid. That is going to get nowhere. One that comes on my street is either one pound a P or two pound. That is going to get nowhere with that. No, he ain't, is that? No, he, no, he ain't. That's well bad, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, he should know. <laughs> and he only does bloody card. Stood there with my cash. Bloody hell. That's well bad, isn't it? Bloody well bad. And then she yeah. says... Yeah, Betty can hear me. <laughs> Girls, what's just happened? So, there's an ice cream van there. You know, Silly. ice cream truck. Yeah. I don't know, but in 30 years, I'm gonna need her for a lawyer. <laughs> I, I can feel it. She's, you, she's ready for the gig. She is. She's gonna be a great lawyer or a Karen. <laughs> or debate. Well, whoever it is, there's gonna be a lot of nervous managers around here. <laughs> hey, it is. You gotta go see Name the show. Karen. Dale Jones, Kevin Patterson, they're gonna be at the Funny Bone Street to St. Charles this weekend. Go check them out, have some fun, and uh, we appreciate y'all being with Thanks us, Thanks for man. having me, man. Thanks I appreciate you, y'all. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, you very it. much.